All right, all right, all right, YouTube. What is up, man? It's your boy, Damn D, POV. And uh, all right, so we got an update. We got an update. Uh, KB just hit me up in a DM. Um, in my last video, I made a video saying that KB got, channel got clapped. Um, and he was in YouTube jail for seven years. But I didn't know that for sure because somebody in my, in my last live stream in the comments was like, yo, Kwame can't go live. And they said that he heard that from Kwame on his IG live. And on his IG live, he explained what happened. Um, but when I went back to KB's Instagram, I didn't see the live stream. Um, but he just hit me up in the DM and he did, it's official. It's official. KB hit me up. He said, yeah, I'm down for a week over some BS. I'm not even going to say the name, but an ad was played on his video. So he got flagged because there was a person's name. I'm not going to say the name because I ain't trying to get flagged. But there was a person name ad that popped up. Um... And YouTube flagged him. I don't know if YouTube picked it up on its own or if somebody told YouTube about it. But one thing that is that is interesting about it is that Gems from Kwame Brown actually said the same thing too in the comment section. So this is the video that I posted earlier today. I said, uh, Kwame Brown channel got flagged again, and he's in YouTube jail for a week, question mark. Is this true or false? And in the comments, gems of Kwame Brown uh, left the comment right here, right above me. I got, a, I got a warning for the same video because it was my first violation of the community guidelines. It was a political ad made by a black man with with clan men uh yeah i'm not gonna say that person's name because i ain't trying to get um any more community strikes but gems of kwame brown got flagged the same way that kb got flagged so like i said there was an ad a political ad a person a certain individual ad got promoted or ad got shown some way somehow on kb's video and youtube i guess didn't like it or somebody reported it and he got a community guideline strike for violation well i don't know what the community guideline strike is for but it's a violation of the community strike and the same thing happened to jim's from from Kwame too, um, yeah. So we won't be seeing KB for about a week. All right. So I just want to give y'all a heads up. Um, shout out to KB, man. Keep your head up, brother. And um, you know, YouTube is a very tricky, tricky, very tricky thing, man. Um, sometimes you just don't know what's going on until you get hit with a strike or a community post and when you get hit with a community post then you you know you can kind of understand what youtube and does and stuff like that like i got hit like, like i recently got hit with a community post i mean a community guideline violation because of kanye i reacted to kanye's video on my other channel and they gave me a violation of community guidelines for hate speech because kanye said what he said i got hit with a youtube guideline violation so yeah man it's just it's just one of them things man it's just it's just one of them things about youtube is it's very tricky very dicey um freedom of speech ain't so freedom right we see what happened to Kanye today. Kanye lost $1.4 billion 
because of what he said. Looks like KB's getting flagged because of what happened, you know? Freedom of speech is not so free. Yeah, you are allowed to say what you want to say, but depending on who you offend, you may have to pay some consequences. You may not. But I just wanted to give this update and uh, let y'all know that KB will be out of commission. KB will be out of commission for a week. It's confirmed. Uh, you know, it happens. It it happens to the best of us. I've been in YouTube jail for like, <laughs> I, th I think I've been in YouTube jail like three times. Hold on, let me see. YouTube jail. So, you know, yep. I know how I feel, KB, right? I know how it feels. Look, uh, let me see. Let me see. How many times have I been in YouTube jail? Right, right here, right? You see this? I was in YouTube jail for seven days. I just got released. This is what happened. So that's that's one time, right? That's one time. And then I got thrown in YouTube jail again. <laughs> I just went to YouTube jail. I just got released. Let's let's talk about it. So I've been penalized and been in YouTube jail two different times and I've been yeah so I already know how this goes man it's very frustrating you know what I'm saying it's very annoying uh so KB I know exactly how you feel right now because I got thrown in YouTube jail two different times and I I've been getting hit with you know guideline violations and strikes and you know it's it's just it's just one of them things that come with the territory when you a content creator man uh you got to be careful what you say man which is very unfortunate you know what i mean they say that this is they say that we have freedom of speech but do we really because they can easily penalize you for information, misinformation, hate speech, violation, all these random titles that they give you just so they can control you. Just so they can control you. They, they will allow you to say some stuff, but if you say the right things, they gonna put you down for a minute. Prime example, Kanye West. Look what Kanye West's words got him. He lost $1.5 billion by Adidas. Adidas dropped him today for the words that he said. Freedom of speech ain't too free. But salute to KB, man. It's been confirmed. KB is in YouTube jail. And we'll see him next week. So it is what it is, man. Uh, hold your head up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this will give you some time to do what you got to do behind the scenes to make sure your channel is OK. You know, make sure you read the guidelines and, you know, make sure everything's, you know, too legit to quit. You know what I'm saying? Um, it happens to everybody. I got thrown in YouTube jail twice, so. I know how it feels, man. But anyway, just wanted to give y'all a little quick update. It has been confirmed. AB is out of commission for a week, man. For a ad that was on his video. I'm not going to say who. I'm not going to say what. But it was something that popped up on his video. And Gems of Kwame Brown got flagged too. But the thing is, there's, a, there's other YouTubers out there that have the same person in their videos that has the same ad in their videos but they didn't get flagged politics 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 i'm out of here y'all y'all leave a comment down below Whew, it's crazy boy this, this tuesday has been real crazy sheesh i'm out y'all peace